Hello everybody, it is Iro Plays or John back at you today with a, another Balloons Tower Defense video. And today what we're going to be doing is we're going to see how many whoops. Gonna we'll move my webcam over there for a second. How many of these here dart monkeys we will be able to actually we're gonna There we go, we can make it a bit smaller. There we go. That's out of the way of everything. All right, so now back to what I was saying. What we're going to do is we're going to see how long we can last with dart monkeys. And obviously, we'll have to get some villages because these guys can't hit camo leads. Or wait, yes, never mind. They can hit camo leads. I forgot about the top route. All right, but before we start off this video, I would like to ask you all, please do hit that like and subscribe button as well as that notification bell. That'll let you know every time I post a video and every time I go live. As well as I'd also like to really thank you guys for all the love and support I got on my last Jurassic Craft video. Uh, it is one of the most liked videos on my channel as well as the second most viewed video on my channel. And I really appreciate it guys. Please do tell your friends and family to check out the channel and, and hit that subscribe button as well. Alright and now we will get into this video and we're going to start off by we're just going to place one of our dart monkeys right there. We'll get a good amount of them placed that way we're safe for a while. There we go. Make sure I got auto start on. All right. And now we're just going to save up. We'll go ahead and get him. Let's see. Where's a good spot for him? Uh, we'll wait to, to see where we can fit a banana farm and all that. The best possible place for him. Alright. Oh, guys, I'd also like to ask you, please do, down in the comments below, while we're saving up this money. I got a lot of cool stuff from over the years, from vacations I've gone on, to uh, trips I've gone on as well for school and that. I got uh, some awards back there, like that plaque up there is a very special one. If you guys would like to know about all that and have me show off some of the cool stuff I've collected overall, because I, I have collected swords, knives, and all that. And a bunch of other really cool stuff. So please let me know down in the comments below if you'd like to see a video over that. Me just showing you all a lot of the cool stuff that I've got. As well as just the backstory of it. The traps. The travels. I don't know. I'd like to do that video. So let me know down in the comments below if, you, if that's something you guys would like to see as well. Alright. Now that we've got enough. He'll put that there, and then him, he can go right there. All right, now, let's see, I just want to get all, all of our guys are going to have enhanced eyesight because I want all of them to be able to hit camos. And then, yeah, I don't know. I've seen a lot of people go quick shot with, with everything, with a lot of those things with dart monkey but I don't know I'm not that big a fan of it so we're going to save up some more get increased production we're just gonna kind of build up our economy for a little bit all right let's see greater production right there I guess we can we'll get this whole track first section of the track down covered first I guess we got because we won't really need a whole lot of what you call uh, them their banana farms yeah we aren't really gonna need a whole lot of them so we can get because these guys are fairly cheap and they're actually fairly powerful for how cheap they are at least their tier fives and final upgrades in that are Let's see come on nope maybe alright alright I can't get them anymore Closer there. Alright, got him down there. Yeah, see right now we're making money fast. We're making money faster than we can spend it, so. So that's just, the banana farms are more for the later rounds when things get do get a little more expensive. Grab all these guys. And yeah, this is I honestly I think these guys can take us pretty far. I really do. So let's go ahead and upgrade them so they can all see camos because I, I don't want to accidentally misclick so you do have like I said, ideally I'd like to get one 
two and all three routes, but that's not how the game works. So we're stuck with losing out on some on some of the upgrades. And then up here, right away, we're going to make get a crossbow and sharp shot. Sharp shots, crossbow. We're gonna make these first four guys. Uh oh. Um. Okay, leads are here. Spike a pole. Are we dead? I'm pretty sure we're dead. No, we're not dead. Okay. So yeah, uh, is it spike a pole? So yeah, we're gonna make that guy. Okay, no, it's Juggernaut that can pop leads. Um. Okay, so. Ooh. we're probably gonna be dead here so what we're gonna do is because that was just very poor spending of money we're going to continue let's see up here and then I think we had about that much afterwards so we're going to sell off a couple of these guys and get him to juggernaut and that should take care of the leads for us Yep, now, now leads are fine. Leads are no deal. So we're just going to... So yeah, like I said, if I think there was nothing else we could have done, like clearly we could have popped the leads had we just been wiser about spending our money. So now this guy is going to go crossbow. This guy will go crossbow. And then I'm, I'm not really the biggest fan of the middle route. I don't know. I... I personally, because you have to keep them below tier three upgrades. So, I mean, I really don't see the point of it. I'd rather get more uh, crossbow master or sharpshooters and juggernauts than I would. All right, let's get another spike a pult. Get you another crossbow. And then triple shot is good. I'm just not that big a fan of get you that and I think that we'll get another just in case there's a big influx of leads we'll get another juggernaut uh, there we go and then, like I said we're we're probably just gonna we'll get the tier 5 just for the sake of getting the tier 5 and all the tier 4s just getting max powers because I don't know off the top of my head if that does do anything so no spike a pult You'll go crossbow. You can go um yeah, spike bolt there, crossbow. And we'll save up for crossbow. So this is really the reason we need the banks because as you can see we're just we really aren't making money super fast. And then we can go spike a bolt there. Yeah, there we go. They're they're dead. Alright. So free play. Now let's go ahead and place another on bake down. Get him up to increased production and on up to greater production. So we're fairly safe for right now. Especially once we start getting I think what we'll do for right now actually is mm, actually we're we're pretty we're doing good right now, so See, is that still in the range? No, that's just out of it. All right, so we're going to sell him. Put him right there. That is within the range. That is within the range, maybe. Let's see. Let's see, is that in the range? No, that is not in the range. So let's see, can we bring him down any more? So that is the farthest we can bring him down and unfortunately that is not in the range but you know what we can do we can go marketplace with that so we can still have him and then we'll just go banana plantations and all that with the rest of these all right now we can get a sharpshooter get a sharpshooter and now we save up some more and we can get valuable bananas on all these guys. Grab the valuable bananas and that way we'll be making even muchas more money. More money is always good. Alright, and now let's see. Another juggernaut. Another juggernaut. Save up to get another juggernaut. 
and then once we get these guys all up to tier fours yeah because as you can see we're doing really good right about now i honestly i think these guys with well especially with the fact that we can get two crossbow masters is really helpful so we'll get him sharpshooter all right and then we'll get him sharpshooter all right you're stuck there we'll get you sharpshooter we'll get you sharpshooter we'll get you sharpshooter there we go all right yeah and now right we're making a lot of good money now we just we line the tracks see and then we just we literally create an a wall a wall of dart monkeys I really think I honestly do really think the dart monkey is a really underappreciated tower in balloons I really like him especially crossbow master let's see so yeah we can fill literally that we can even fill in this section of the inner portion right there uh-huh saw a white line there we go let's see come on let me no all right you ain't gonna let me all right so we're gonna do that uh, we're up to twelve thousand already so go ahead and just pump that right back into econ get all those up to banana plantations and now we'll go ahead and get triple shot on a bunch of these guys and triple shot all right and now here you go more sharpshooters more sharpshooter and more sharpshooter uh, juggernaut uh, juggernaut juggernaut a sharp shooter oh, now we're actually see this is the thing we get we can get a lot of money but we can blow through it really fast because these later upgrades get fairly expensive we can grab a triple shot we can grab another triple shot yeah see this is why we really need a lot of dart monkeys to do this good so and if you guys let me know what you guys think down below what your favorite balloons tower defense six monkey is or tower whatever you really want to call it another sharpshooter let's see we can make you another sharpshooter and then that takes care of them on the inside there all right let's see i think we can yeah we can fit enough we can definitely fit another farm right down here yeah there we go let's see and that does pretty much max out the amount of farms we can get so boom save up for another plantation there we go oh look at that they're just getting destroyed and juggernauts are also really powerful so all right now let's go ahead and get back to lining we don't want to do too much on lining without upgrading because in the first form the dart monkeys aren't that super powerful when you just get a line of the upgrade styles we have it's just the balloons don't stand a chance so grab the monkeys grab the monkeys also let me know what you guys' favorite of the balloon star to tower defense series games are personally i'm i really like five six is a very close second but i do really like five um because that was the one i played the most and that was the one i actually let's see real quick uh -huh. there we go and that was the one i actually got to over round i want to say it was 350 on my phone before it caused my phone and game to crash completely uh, because of ju there's just too much going on and my phone couldn't handle it all right now we'll get these guys up get another juggernaut oh we can get an ultra juggernaut i think we're gonna want we'll get an ultra juggernaut we'll make him the ultra juggernaut because he can hit the most places so we got him up now we'll get him to sharpshooter him to triple shot 
him to sharpshooter him to sharpshooter and if you guys couldn't tell of the dart monkeys upgrade pass the bottom is my personal favorite and i honestly think it is the most powerful can i fit another monkey right there uh yeah we can get another sharpshooter so and i think the overall goal for crossbow masters is we'll get them both right and i think we'll make him one of our crossbow masters and then i think we'll make him our crossbow master i think we'll make these two guys our crossbow masters i think that is the best way to go about that another juggernaut then we'll get another triple shot then another triple shot then we'll make him a sharpshooter then we'll make him a juggernaut so yeah guys look at, we're already on round 78 and this is just with dart monkeys alone i mean i honestly i really think we can get past round 100 with these i really do these i mean they're just so overpowered when you get a mass of them like this i mean we just have the track aligned with them and then we'll grab another sharpshooter <laughs> back at it grab another sharpshooter and then we'll grab a triple shot and then um i guess central market i think does i think i have the uh, monkey power i think that gives you a life every time at the end of every round or t a life or four something like that along those lines so we're, we'll see at the end of this round if that is if i do have that monkey knowledge point or not no i do not all right either way gives us extra money at the end of each round so excuse me all right let's see all right so you can fit any no all right so then there 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 so it's what's really overpowered about and the reason i chose this map is because i think this is the map we can get the furthest on because it just it intercrosses itself so many ways where we can get a lot of dart monkey hits in and let's see and a lot of this is really just how well you upgrade and how quickly you upgrade and how wise you are about spending your money all right, we can go ahead and grab one of them. Get back to line. I think what we're going to do is we're just going to finish putting around the outside. Then we'll upgrade all of uh, all these guys. And that's it. Look at it. We, these guys can hit the end of the track as well. So actually, I think I think I'm going to make him and him my crossbow masters because he can hit the end of the track as well as the beginning of it. So boom, one crossbow master. Make sure, yeah, I do have that monkey knowledge point. I thought that was the one I made sure to get. And then another crossbow master, or another sharpshooter, not a crossbow master. He will be our crossbow master. Boom, 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 boom. There we go. And then another sharpshooter. Make you a triple shot. Make you a juggernaut make you a triple shot then we'll make you we'll make a good amount of the rest of you sharpshooters we'll make you a juggernaut and then we'll make you a juggernaut there we go and then you can be a triple shot you and you can be a triple shot and then the rest of the you guys will be sharpshooters there we go got to be careful i don't accidentally spam click and upgrade one of them all the way to what's it called a uh, crossbow master because we are making a good amount of money rather quickly all right i think we're pretty good for right now so i think what we'll do is we'll save up oh no we're not no we're not oh we survived but just barely so that tells me we need more juggernauts right away 
we need more juggernauts like we needed more juggernauts like yesterday is what that tells me so we're just gonna make this entire inner area juggernauts yeah we're just gonna make this entire inner area juggernauts because I really I want to make it to round 100 with these guys because I really believe we can I really believe we can make it to round 100 come on I you know there's an area there all right more juggernauts more juggernauts are on the menu oh no no we're dead we can't get survive it well well everyone that is where you can make it to in balloon tower defense 6 with only the cross or not with only crossbow masters but with only the dart monkey you can make it to round 93 i hope you all enjoyed everyone have a great night see you later